All right, so welcome back to the video course. Now, during this video, I'm going to talk about the different screen recording software that you can use to make videos just like the one I'm using right now. So let's go ahead and dive into the one that I'm actually using right now, and this is called Voila. And I think that's how you pronounce it, I'm not 100% sure. This is for the Mac only because I'm using a Mac, and I purchased this software for $29.99 on the App Store, and I believe they have a free trial available. Now you can see in the picture what it looks like. This is great. You can record any size, any dimensions that you want. You can record your webcam. You can record browsers. You can take pictures. All kinds of awesome things like that. And that's what it looks like. Something else that you can use is Camtasia. Like I said in the previous video, this is actually a video editing software and a screen recording software in one. $299 for the PC or $99 for the Mac. Not 100% sure why it's cheaper on the Mac because they do the exact same thing, but that's just the way they priced their products. Something else you can check out is ScreenFlow. If you have a Mac, it is $99 and they have a free trial available. And last but not least, when I am recording on my PC, I use Active Presenter. It is for the PC only. They do have a free option. They also have some paid options, but they do have a free option that you can use it as well. Now, same thing as the video editing software. When it comes to screencast software, as long as it records your screen in HD, that's the main point, then it's going to be okay. It is very important that you can record in HD. There's a lot of screen recording softwares, and a lot of them are going to, uh, what's the word, they're going to compress your recording as they are recording it, and then it won't be in HD, and then it looks a little blurry, your students have a hard time viewing it. You want to make sure everything is crisp HD. Okay, so again, if you have any questions about a software or if you're not sure if it's compressing your videos, hop over into the Slack page that we have, our Slack group, and just ask one of us, ask me or one of the many, you know, hundred students, and we'll be glad to assist you. So again, these are the ones that I have used and that I can personally vouch for. If you can find one that's free or cheaper, feel free to check it out and ask us on the Slack group if you're not sure about it.